Hello and welcome to my exploded Amiga A500. Uh, the reason why I've taken it apart, I've got that's my old disk drive and that's my new one. Uh, just to quickly show you, uh, I've cleaned Well I can't get members to work anymore for some reason and Or can I? So I used to be able to get lemmings to work before. All I get is this message. The old famous software failure. Press left mouse button to continue. Guru, meditation, whatever that means, and all those numbers. You can see that, that on the flashing means nothing's working. So, going around in circles here, let's try a different disc. Let's try Jaguar, I don't know if this one works. Oop. Let's do Control Amiga Amiga to reset it. No, it's not working. Okay, let's try Lotus Turbo Oh that has a Has a read white error. Um, so maybe it's a disc, I don't know. Let's try one more game. Trying a different one now. Disc error number two. So I don't know. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to turn it off and put in that I got on eBay that a couple of weeks back. Let's try that one and see what happens. Okay, so you have to disconnect it from there to there.
quick easy swap over so you just plug that one in there that one in there Get in, put it back roughly. Okay, so I know the actual computer works. Got myself worried there for a second. Okay, I've got the, that's always a good sign when you get that hand logo. Nope, still nothing. See this lemmings. I'm not even getting that glowy message. So I don't know what to do because uh no, it's Tobo. So, I'm all out of options here. Um, I've got all these discs, all these full drawers are full of uh, games, well not games, but I'd like these to quickly show you. These are my drawing graphics. Uh, excellent text, so it's like word editing, page setter, and things like that. But you've got fonts, and then those are my demos which I made. Uh, then these are my miscellaneous utilities cover disc and music discs, like. Uh, virus checker, uh, X copy, uh, all the utilities, um, spectrum emulator, utilities like X copy three, um, workbench. I don't think even. Workbench, that's not even the workbench. Work. I should have checked that on the other drive. Uh, what are these? These are covered discs. When I've got magazines, many um, like Amiga Computing, Amiga Power, Amiga Format, these are old discs, uh, Amiga magazines in the 1990s you used to be able to get. Uh, public domain, uh, mega format. So these are all like all cover discs I used to be able to get. Got some music discs. Uh, and these are all my games. I've got playing games like Wings of Fury, F18 bit, and like Lotus Turbo. These are my car games. If Monaco, got Turbo's Turbo. Challenge, uh, Jaco X Day 220, Supercars, Content so Bike. I've got one bike, set, one bike game, Harley Davidson, and uh, sports games. And these are compilations uh, 3D pool. I think that goes stunt car, manic mine. Oh, look, manic miner. <laughs> Rockstar ate my hamster. 
Well, that's a good game that was. I used to enjoy playing Better Dead and Alien, Battleships, 3D Breakout, uh, Rizball, GB Root, you know, all, all my compilations. And these are like just games like Pac Man, South Park Cafe. Oh, that's a good game. South Park Cafe. I don't think that will work. No. People games where like you have to control it, battle chairs, Robo Cod, PP Hammer, Rick Dangerous, Gods, Brat, Hero Crest, and then shoot him up it's like you know they Gravity Force, Future Shark, Cybernoid, Gravity Force, uh double discs is like where there's more than one game. I mean one more than one disc. Like um Lemmings, Secret, Mar Secret of Marlin Secret of Monkey Island. So it's like where a game needs more than one disc. And then this is this, this bits and old. I think these are like blank discs. And then. Oh, this is. All like just bits of paper which I've written things down, like little notes about how to do things on certain games and that. So little reminders. This I made this at college about 20 odd years ago. Like this this bit should be on there, but it's fallen off. Uh, this was all one. I made this woodwork at college. Believe it or not, this was. This was all entire one piece of wood, and I had to get my. I think it was Tim, my woodwork teacher, was called, and I had to cut it all up. I made a little mistake. See, see it should be like looking like that, at both corners, but I made it about one centimetre too short. That's why I've put that little extra bit there. I had this in my head, this idea. I wanted like loads of discs, so I thought oh, I knew I was going to get loads of discs. You see, I need to. I had nowhere to put all these discs, so I had to, and then had this space to go on the, on the monitor, this space here for a printer, which I used to have, and then space there for the second disc drive. Um, so, it's last, apart from this bit's fallen off, so I need to glue and nail back on at some point. So, as you can see, that's a new, which I bought on eBay this one a few weeks ago. And it all works apart from the two disk drives. And I'm not sure if it's a disk drive that don't work or the um, discs. I think that disk drive works, still works, because when I've when I done Lemmings a couple of weeks back, that worked. So. So I'm all out of ideas. So what I really need, not a second hand one, because that's the second hand, that's got the date on it, you see, 0391. And this one, 0191. Tune on, so maybe if I can get hold of a brand new disk drive. I don't know if they still make them for Amiga. I think that's what I need to do. A brand new disk drive. I, maybe eBay, I don't know, because I bought this one from eBay and it didn't, didn't really work out too well. It lasted for a little while, but then it stopped working, so I don't know. So anyway, I'm going to have to put it, I'm going to put all this back together again. I don't want to lose all my screws which I've got sitting about. Okay well, thanks for watching. Bye.